because last night was Major League Baseball's opening night. How exciting. Spring is here. Yeah. Feels good. Feels good. Last night's opening night, and it's perfect timing because I think some of the games from last year just ended. <laughs> I'm just saying, our national pastime rewards the patient. <laughs> Yesterday, there was a World Series rematch between the Mets and the Royals, and here in New York, it feels like October all over again, <laughs> in that it's 30 degrees and raining. <laughs> I want to apologize to our audience here. Earlier, we had to roll a tarp over them. <laughs> They're very good. They're very good. <laughs> and even though we're just one day into the season, ESPN has already picked the Toronto Blue Jays to win the World Series. <laughs> win the World Series, that's right, yeah. I don't think, I don't think that's fair. Because Canada uses the metric system. <laughs> and if you convert... And it looks like Colbert doesn't like what he's seeing out there. He's looking for a different joke from the writers. <laughs> Meanwhile, in Las Vegas, the Cubs are a four to one favorite to win the World Series. That. That would be the biggest upset since... Shakes off another one. What do you think he's looking for out there? Well, he might want to go straight down the middle. Maybe a joke about Donald Trump's hair. Yeah, sure. And... Here comes the manager. And Colbert is none too happy about it. He wants to stay in and finish this thing. Sure, well, while they work this out, Let's go to the kiss cam. <laughs> and he's refusing to give up the ball. You hate to see this. <laughs> and it's over. The manager looks like he's calling in someone else to close. Who's that coming out? Let's see. It's Hall of Fame pitcher Pedro Martinez. Yes, indeed. Martinez has three Cy Young Awards and over 3,000 career strikeouts. On the other hand, after 18 seasons in the major, zero jokes told. Here's the windup. And the joke. The opening day game at Yankee Stadium was postponed due to bad rain. But the New York Post still blamed it on A-Rod. <laughs>